Bits, and welcome back to another uh, Pokemon Br uh, Shining Pearl Nuzlocke episode. Uh, last we left off, I went and I evolved Kefka and also uh, Nero here because they're trade evolutions. So now we have Gengar and Alakazam. So I want to hop right into this by getting into the gym. Looks like it's a water type. means oh wait no you are perfect for the front looks like we're gonna be changing water levels come here kid my body isn't the only thing I work on toughening up here I also work on my Pokemon and my spirit bum bum Bum, bum, ba -da, bum. To reject. Weasel. Well, that weasel is dead. Go, Cindy. I know one Pokemon that's going to not be useful in this gym. <laughs> we are not using Graveler. Or Golem, I mean, Gargantua. Tuber Jackie. Wow, trainer! You just might be tougher than our gym leader. Well, I mean, I have an electric type and they have a water type. Okay. Before I go up there... Can't go that way. Okay. Push the button. I have mastery over the incredible powers of water. You won't win. Barboach. Barboach, is that a ground type or is it... I think it doesn't get ground until it evolves. Let's find out! Okay, Barboach gets it right away. Battle! Fight it! Dang! Okay, so we need to watch out for barboaches. But the kid wins anyways, and I'm just bowled over. sir. I've traveled all over the globe while raising Pokemon. This is the gym I've chosen. You'll find it a handful for sure. Let me guess. Wingle or Seagull? Or Pelipper, I mean. Yep. Looks like he's gonna have both. Not the evolved form, just Wingle. Spark! <laughs> Wishing to be praised. You, you're kind of top class tough. I did it. Push the button. Come here, girl. 
Time to beat you up. I want to become a strong trainer like Crash or Wake. That was so weird. She was holding it on her back and then all of a sudden the tube teleported onto her. Spark! Does the Zural have the fairy type thing? Or does it pick it up? Meryl! Man, I remember when this thing... Everyone uh, would say that you got a blue Pikachu if you used this, uh, name your Pikachu at the start and pick a blue. Ugh, you're too much. Landed the most fish in the world out next. Are they all Magikarps? Also, can I fish in the gym? I've already caught something in this town, right? I still want to see if I can fish in the gym just to... Oh, it's Barboach. It's gonna take two hits. Never mind. Good job, Cindy. A Gyarados, huh? How does your Gyarados feel about becoming an electric rod? Goodbye, Gyarados. Ooh, Kefka, Leviathan, and Rubiconte. Good job, you three. Being number one in the world doesn't mean a thing. this take me? Next. Let me guess. More Wingles? Like the raging you see, I crash down and wash away everything before me. That's just how I roll. Uh, I think Shellos is just water. I could be wrong. Yep, super effective. A wingle. Oh no! It's a flying water type! Bye, wingle. Hey, it's the blue shellos. Blue Shellos, I feel like, is the better. Although, what's with the weird wing things it has? That wave didn't even wash my hands. Okay, well. 
Time to push your button. I did fight him, right? Yep. Welcome! I don't get challenged very often. The glory you are now beholden is the Pastoria Gym Leader. That's right, I'm Crash Awake. My Pokemon were toughened up by the stormy white waters. They'll take everything you can throw at them and then pull you under. Victory will be ours! Come on, let's get it done! Um, okay. Now this is a gym I don't think I'm going to lose the Pokemon in at all. Nice crit, Cindy. Clangsire. That's water ground. You know what? Kafka urine. Hypnosis. Good job, Kafka. Yeah, Cindy's coming back in. And also got rid of the Intimidate. Hey, that there, that was a good move. Ice Fang. Come on! It's gone and ended. How will I say this? I want more. I wanted to battle a lot more. I can't believe I just had one HP. It seems the undertold pulled me under, but I had a great time battling with you. You've earned this. The Fen badge. The what badge? Fen? You need that Fen badge to use the hidden move defog from your Pokatch. Is there a special reward for me in recognition of your team's powers? You've obtained the stickers that Wake uses. You've obtained TM55. I'm assuming that's Brine? Yep. It inflicts double the damage on targets with less than half their HP left. Use it to end battles decisively. Oh my god, Cindy. Had a heart attack there. Don't do that to me. You've beaten, so how was it? Uh, okay. I just wanted to see if they said anything special. I, I can't believe. Try exploring Pastorio. Okay, you know what? You can go to that slot. I'm looking for where the Poke Center was. Uh, 
<laughs> yes, heal, please. Question is, where does it want me to wander to? Down here? No. Don't think I caught a Pokemon on this route yet. I don't know if this swamp here is a. Uh... I'm assuming I can't get into a battle here. Okay. Exploring Pastoria. Oh, this way probably. Welcome to the Great Marsh. Is this your first safari game? Yes. When you enter the Great Safari Marsh, you'll receive... Oh! Well, what's going to be our safari zone catch? Was our catch? Uh, okay. Yep. We failed our catch. Uh, sometimes thinking I get so flustered, tried to get out, I have no luck catching anything. There's a pair of binoculars to look over the Great Marsh. You can see what kind of Pokemons can be caught and where they are. Uh, sure. Meryl. Psyduck. Psyduck. Doodoot. Scroopy. Okay. There are shuttle trains in the mark called Quick Trams. Take those. Tell me I'm not imaginist. The Great Marsh's Pokemon seem to be different from the ones yesterday. No, I don't want to catch anything. I just wanted to see what was up there, but... You were eavesdropping. I was just talking loudly to myself. If I wasn't in a hurry, I'd pulverize you with my Pokemon. But I have to get uh, on my way to the lake as soon as you're lucky I'm... Oh, and listen up. Don't you dare follow me. Okay. Follow you. Got it. Gwah! Persistent pest. If our plan works, our boss's dream comes closer to fruition. Our boss's ideal word is, world is going to be created, so I'm not going to waste my time on a nobody like you. I'm telling you now, don't you come chasing after me. Whoops. <laughs> I'm not always going to plow into you every time we meet. So how's it going, Escorian? Buffing up your Pokemon, eh? I'll test you and your Pokemon out to see how buff and tough you are. 
Fine, I will kill you, Ralph. Starly. Well... I actually can't hurt Starly with Kefka, so... dare do that. Stop it. Okay. Whew. I got a little worried there. Nice, and it even crit. Good job, Cindy. What's next, the Bidoof? <laughs> Mate Shade, forget an old move, please. I don't care about meme look. One, two, and three. Say goodbye, Prin Plop. Another crit. Roselia, such Pokemon. Kefka. Kefka's Nightshade will do 30 damage exact. X. Good job, Kefka. Kill the flower. Gargantua leveled up. Nice. Ponyta. Uh, have fun, Leviathan. Yeah, I can tell you raised your Pokemon to be tough. Leviathan, Aqua Tail it. Slap. Good job, Leviathan. Ralph. What just happened? You're telling me I lost? <laughs> yeah, maybe you did get a bit tougher since last time. That even shocked me a bit, so yeah, I got beat because I was careless. So hey, what was that Team Galactic guy all, all freaking out about? I don't know how what he's up to, but you should chase him down. If you're not a Pokemon and you run like that, you're a bad guy. Alright, Escoria, next time I'm not holding back. Am I chasing him down? <laughs> that was oh that's neat because kefka's out of the ball walking around with me oh that's cool hey why is he... We need that energy to make this. It would take a scientific genius to make something like this. Therefore, our boss who made this is a scientific genius. Grr, you were eavesdropping. I was just thinking out loud. You're a persistent pest. I'm getting tired of running away. 
But I'm not going to waste my energy knocking you around. Come back! There he is. We know he's going to the leg. Can't, why am I running away like this anyway? That new universe the boss was talking about. It's giving me goosebumps thinking about it, so we use this. What? You were eavesdropping. I was only talking to myself. You're persistent too. I'm pooped out from all the running. But I'm not going to battle you. I'm going to pull out a gun and shoot you. Oh no, you're still on my tail. The lake's within sight. Leave me no choice. My Pokemon will knock you out. Oh no, it's gonna be a Wormpole. Oh, nope. Glammeow. No. Kefka literally can't do anything against it. Let's go with Rubiconte. I shouted at it, apparently. Good night. <laughs> if I didn't run, I could have battled harder. Can't battle anymore, I'm running on fumes. I'll have to give this to the commander. I wish I got to use it at the lake. Oh, well, hello. Long time no see. How is your Pokedex filling up? Came to research the folklore about the lake, but... Well, it doesn't appear as if the lake is open to the public now. Have you heard the folklore about it? They say there is an island inside the lake and that a mysterious Pokemon resides there. No one must enter the chamber of that Pokemon. Sorry to change the subject, but have you seen the group of Psyduck on Route 210? Yes. Yes, that's right, by the cafe on Route 210. You've seen that group of Psyduck huddled with their heads in their uh, hands? Anyway, what you should do is use this medicine on the Psyduck. You're working on a Pokedex, so it would be worthwhile for you. I went on a big adventure with a Pokedex when I was younger. May help you uncover the secret behind the mysterious Pokemon you're searching for. I hope you get to meet every kind of Pokemon there is to see. See you later. To protect the lake, it's nice to know that there are still people worth admiring like that. I believe his name was Cyrus? We've been asked to keep everyone out of the lake area. Reason? I'm not too sure, but apparently to protect the lake. Um... Colossian time. Hey, a star raptor. Psyduck are standing firm. They aren't inclined to move. Would you like to use the secret medicine? Yes. The Psyduck to appear to be cured of their chronic headache. Did we catch a Pokemon on this route? What route is this? This is 210. I think this is one of the routes we missed. Oh good, you used the secret medicine I gave you. Psyduck are known to suffer from chronic headache. But no one's been able to figure out what triggers the headaches. Oh yes, can I ask you a big favor? I want you to deliver this old charm to my grandma in Celestic Town. I know there are some rare Pokemon between here and Celestic Town, so it'll be worth your while to go. Yes, sure. A old charm. My grandma has this sort of bossy air about her. I think you'll recognize her right away. Yes, I'm sure you will. She's the elder of Celestic Town. 
As for the location, look on your town map. You can't miss it. Okay, I'm counting on you. See you again. Okay, double check. Uh, check summary. 209, 202, 218, Ravage Path, Grand Underground, Lake Verity. We're looking for 210. 209. 15 Okay And just a couple more to check Okay, we have not Come across a Pokemon here, so Well, we've already fought a Krikatoon. Or caught one, rather. be my phone. Apologies, I thought it was muted. Hi, ninja. I'm one of the ninja trio. Being discovered means I must battle. Okay, no suits. Missed. Uh, please don't kill. Okay, we're fine. Well, it disabled it. Please. Yeah, we're going to switch. Waterfall. Good, that Geodude died. Focus energy, yeah. Another Geodude? <laughs> Not what I was expecting from a ninja. I could see defeat. Cricketune. That's a nice little touch that if they're walking with you, they, uh... Wow. What is this encounter rate? And I don't want Cricketune! Hyper Potion. Also, there's apparently three ninjas, so... Oh my god! Really? With the Krikatoons? Mm. 
Now, I just checked, there are other things here. And there's only two other Pokemon we can get. So it's a choice, well, technically three because four, because there's the evolved forms of the two. I see one of the ninjas up at the top right. I'm one of the ninja trio. Being discovered means I must battle. But how did you discover me? Don't tell me you're a ninja too. He's only got one. Stunky. Uh, actually, no, that's a dark type. That would be bad. Yeah. Let's go with Rubiconte. Punch. This should be neutral. Wow. This should evolve Rubiconte now, right? Close combat. Yes, please. Um, I don't need Mach Punch with how fast. I also don't need Torment. So why not? Ta-da! Torment and learn close combat. Now are you going to evolve? Oh, the Conte is evolving! This is the final evolution for my party, isn't it? Nice. Infernate. Its crown of fire is indicative of its fiery nature. It is beaten by none in terms of quickness. I don't believe that. However... I kind of want to bring in, uh, you know what, I'm bringing in Zubat. Death Gaze, you're switching with Une. And Death Gaze is also going to walk together with me. Ponyta. Alright, give me a Machop or a Hoodoo. One of the two games. Now where is... there's the third ninja. Game, please. Bonsley. Let's go, kid. I'm one of the ninja trio. Being discovered means I must battle. That's all you say?
Zubat. Hey, I have one of those. Death Gaze is following me around right now. Zubat. Two levels on Death Gaze. Scroopy. Yeah, sure. I don't think Scroopy's. Oh! Ah! Hex. Oh! Guess it didn't matter. <laughs> nice, Death Gaze gained two more levels. Learned Mean Look. I concede defeat. Give me my, my Chop or my Hoodoo Please game. Also like how I'm getting an encounter even before I finish taking a step. What the heck is up with the encounter rates here? Chop, so I can have all those trade evil Pokemon. I've never actually used one, I don't think. Hmm. Ultra Ball. Maybe. I was gonna say, maybe it's in this grass here. No, I'm in the right area. Okay. Let's just keep running around in the grass. That long grass wasn't the right spot before. I actually can't use Defog. Is it going to be a Hoodoo or is it going to be a Machop? Or Machop? Or a knockdown. I'll 
pick any one of those four. Looks like we get a knock double. Battle hypnosis. Did I buy any of the nest balls out of curiosity? I did. I just want to see if one will catch this. I don't think it will. Or it will. Let's see. Hey! Cindy. Leviathan. And Death Gaze. If it flips its head upside down, it's a sign that it is engaged in very complex thinking. Yes. Uh, it's a male. Let's name it Rufus. Where do you want to send it to? Send it to a box. Let's hope I didn't send it to the graveyard. I think about it. Okay. <laughs> oh, sure. Now that I come across the knock owl. Knocked Owl is flying normal, so. Even if I wanted to fight it right now. Is there. Do I have Defog? I don't have it, right? Missed it somewhere. <laughs> Oops. Okay. I missed talking to, uh, Pastoria. Did I? If I dig here, do I get to one of the, um, let me check. Just wanted to see if I ended up down at the bottom. I'll catch one from each of the areas that separates it. Cannot catch anything in the safari zone because the hoodoo ran away. But I need to waste 500 more. Here we go. 
Now we can fly back. Got our catch on this route, which was knocked out. So, oh. there we go. I could use the hidden move defog. I'd clear up the weather in two flaps of Astoravia's wings. How does defog work, you ask? Third Pokemon flap their wings to blow the fog away. Another ninja, huh? I just startled you. While you're still struggling to recover, I'll already be the winner. Dun, dun. A Zubat! Honestly, probably just kill these without sleeping them first. I want Shadow Ball. But I don't know what level Gengar learns things at. Job, death gaze. Eh. Rock blast. Wow. Destroyed. Go back. What's with you? You didn't give me any openings. Got it. Good job, Bidoof. Pat, pat, pat. As an ace trainer, I have to take all battles in stride. I need to stay cool and calm whether I win or lose. Uh-oh. Put it to sleep. Great, Kafka's going on one of his long speeches again. 
Death Gaze is now level 15. Poison Fang, yes please. Mean look. Astonish. Let's get rid of that. Grottle. Rubicante, that's all you. Death Gaze is level 16 now. Ay, we lost! Here comes the trainer, Zach. You ready? Let's do this. Jen, watch this. I'm gonna use everything you've taught me. Raichu and Gyarados. Kefka and Sinai. Oh no, I've been intimidated. I'm actually a little scared about that Gyarados. Hypnosis, Raichu. Uh, yeah, my great strategy, Cindy, is just to uh, spark that Gyarados. Kefka's level 32 now, and Death Gaze is level 17. Next, Raichu. Fight! Good night, Raichu. <laughs> Nice, level 18 Death Gaze. Gargantua, level 37. I just got embarrassed in front of my little buddy here. Oof, you got called little buddy. Oh, someone that's even better than Jen. That's a lot of money, holy crap. Did you see that? Seem to be having... You seem to have a lot of confidence. Let's see if it's justified. I don't even remember what evolves into Motham. I love how its wing flaps slowed down there. I cannot remember for the life of me what evolves into Motham. Luxio. Yeah. That can have bite or crunch. I believe that is a boy. You can tell by the little hair tip on its head. What's your third Pokemon? Death Gaze is now level 19. Rubicante level 37. Onyx. 
Well, why not? Bulldoze it, Gargantua. It's like, oh no! I gotta get stronger! That's it, I knew you could do it. Haha, -ha, a total loss for me. Buff physique isn't just for show. Good, you probably have a fighting type Pokemon. Oh my gosh, poison jab? Go to sleep. Thirty-three, Cindy's thirty-eight. Uguar! Ninja. The ninjas appear where you least expect us. Gunk. Perfectly fine. Have I used a Gengar before? I can't remember if po in Pokemon I used a Gengar. Oh well. Hey, Death Gaze is level 20. Quick guard. I don't care about that. Cool that. Sure. Hypnosis! Go to sleep. Good thing they remember to flap their wings while they're asleep. I didn't expect to lose. Well, you did. Death, death gaze, please! Smoke ball! That allows me to run away no matter what. Which, I believe, also ghost type has. Yep, I thought this would just be loot. Thank you, Wild Bidoof. I also see that down there. <gasps> Ooh. I'm very tempted to give that to Gengar right away. I know Gengar learns it, but it's not till like level 40 something. I'll teach you about the charms of bird Pokemon. Oh crap. Birdkeeper Brianna. Huh? 
this is where we switch. Because I can't damage normal type. Yeah, let's just go with Leviathan. Thanks for just growling me. Great strategy. Okay. Waterfall it. Waterfall it again. Oh, I guess you're going to crunch this one. Echoed voice. That did nine damage. <laughs> Woo! We gained four HP. And Leviathan and Death Gaze both leveled up. Ooh, Dragon Dance. Um I like Waterfall because it can flinch. And crunch for some tight coverage. You know what? Goodbye, Aquatel. Twenty one death gaze, nice. Wow, I admit I'm quite surprised. Me lose to someone so young? I dare say not. A veteran? Yep, veteran Brian. Weasel. I'm just gonna use Hex and see if it kills. It does. Giraffe Rig, I believe, is normal psychic. Super effective. Chomp. Good job, Cindy. Um, a choke? No, well, let's just keep Cindy in. We'll spark him. Spark! Oh, wow. Right again. Spark. The power of youth, it's startling. Berries. Where am I, anyways? Oh, okay, I'm about to hit the town. Ricky Berries? Glove Berries.
All right, perfect. We made it to this town. Doo -doo. They say this town has been here since Sinnoh was made. What would bring you to a place so far off the beaten path? There's nothing to see here but some ancient Pokemon etching. Oh, now this is interesting. Let's see your Pokemon. It's warming up to you in a very nice way. We'll grow even more friendly if you travel with it some more. Restore my Pokemon, please. Point, point, point. Three Premier Balls and three regular Pokeballs. Perfect. All right. But thank you, everyone, for watching. Hopefully you have enjoyed. If you have, be sure to leave a like, comment, subscribe. And remember, I ask the Knights, share the love. Goodbye. Thank you guys for watching, and a huge thank you to my patrons. Without you guys, I wouldn't be able to make the content I do and do what I love to do. So thank you very much, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Goodbye.